day's tale is of the birth of a thing called reputation. That subtle essence by which we know what is right and what is to be respected and what is to be feared without ever really knowing anything. The example I'll use today is a fellow who's come to be known as Tom, the president. Many of you have probably never heard of, but that's only because you're yet to experience his reputation. <laughs> <laughs> many years ago, many years ago, at an event, a young boy showed up. He was wearing tennis sneakers. He had two towels sewn together. He had a sword of Greek rattan, wearing lightly colored padding, which clearly was designed more for skateboarding than for fighting. <laughs> <laughs> he showed up on the field. People were not impressed. <laughs> he showed up. He swung his sword with the genius that only youth could have. His reflex is the speed that only youth could have. His opponents were not impressed. <laughs> <laughs> when he left the field that day, defeated, no one really cared. <laughs> Six months later, he showed up. He was still wearing tennis sneakers. His uh, fighting guard looked a little bit more realistic. And uh, the pads which protected his arms were not quite as brightly colored. <laughs> and this fight he lost too. But it took time. And each time his opponent swung at him and hit his shield, the shield bent just a little. Just a little. But at the end of that fight, as one looked at the bent, shield, with which he had defended himself nobly, although he lost. One would vision would see not a, shield, not a shield at all. One would see the shell of an egg. And slowly, event by event, with each blow upon his shield, it bent until it was. And slowly, event by event, not just his shield, that his sword began to gain reputation. And somehow, with each victim that fell to the earth, if you looked very carefully at the shell of the shield, you'd see not an intact egg, but a small crack in that egg. And piece by piece, blow by blow, opponent by opponent, that shell began to crack. For one day, the first who had to be one. And one saw not just the cracked egg, but the cracked egg filled with that. And so, event by event, year by year, as his God became a little bit more acceptable, as his armor became a little bit more technologically advanced. <laughs> and his blows became slower because the man was aging. And his reflexes became slower because he could not see it well. And then, ten years later, an old man walked upon the field. His leather was false. His garb pristine and intact. And all who saw his, saw his blades and knew they were facing Tom, Tom the Traveler. And they would look at an old man and they would say, this is my victory. And then they would look on his shoulder for sat bird reputation. And that bird would spread its wings. And the shadow would fall upon the younger man. The faster man. Or the 
words they are. That would be nothing. But it is.